How did you get the injury on your hand? I don't know. You have one opportunity forever to talk to this guy. Forever. In that house, I was throwing hangers and stuff in, in my suitcase. I was doing my little crazy what I do. What do you mean you're running around doing what you do? What do you mean? What do you mean you, you, you cut yourself in Chicago, but the blood got on the Bronco before you left? What do you mean? There's a million things that they just let go. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah, uh-huh. Oh, my God. He came to the wake. It was just unbelievable. And we were all kind of in shock that he, that he came there. What I had heard is that that her, her head was almost cut off all the way. I mean, I don't know, it was just terrible. He was like on Xanax or something. He was just sedated. I had no idea what was going on. The Los Angeles Police Department right now is actively searching for Mr. Simpson. The gasp that went through the room, I think it's right at that moment that I realized, oh boy, this is big. He's gone. I looked at Marika and I said, it's a helicopter story now. Let's find this son of a bitch. I've covered so many of these things. This was not usual police behavior. If O.J. Simpson were black, that shit wouldn't have happened. He'd be on the ground getting clubbed. But because he transcended race and color to this exalted status of celebrity, he got a motorcade. This is not a chase. This is basically an accompaniment. We're, we're dumbfounded. Law enforcement is following Simpson. They want him to stop. Red lights and siren. It's not an escort. Why are they allowing him to continue? Maybe around the next curve, they've got it marked off, and they're, they're going to just force the stop. If they requested SWAT to handle something, that's because they can't handle it themselves. I was told, you're going to do the, the talking. You're going to be the negotiator. He had asked me to come out to the car, and I said, no, you're going to show them yourself. You're going to show them just how, how big and courageous you are. You're going to walk to me, and you're going to leave the gun in the car. You're going to walk out and, and, and show everyone right now you're going to do this. He looked a mess. He looked like someone who had committed murder. This case is covered up under the rug. We will never trust the criminal justice system again. You turned O.J. Simpson into a civil rights cause. You would all regret that? Absolutely not. O.J. Simpson was a vessel. He was merely a tool that allowed something to come out and be exposed. So you were using O.J. Simpson for your own cause? I was using O.J. Simpson for our cause, for black people's cause. We, the jury, in the above entitled action, find the defendant, Orenthal James Simpson, not guilty. That, that, that was joy. You, you could hear it in the barbershop or the beauty salon, or in the classroom at the school, or on the streets. A release of breath, exhaling. 267 days, that's how long the trial lasted. Mm -hmm. 1,105 pieces of evidence, mm -hmm. 45,000 pages of trial transcript from 133 witnesses. How the hell did you deliberate for three and a half hours? How many days was it again? 267 days. 266 nights. Wasn't able to talk to other jurors, wasn't able to talk to family. Nobody but me and my thoughts. Do you think that there are members of the jury that voted to acquit OJ because of Rodney King? Yes. You do? Yes. How many of you think felt that way? Oh, probably 90% of them. Wow. 
Where we go that night? Probably home and cried. You know, I'll never get over it. It's all it's still there. Close to the surface, it's always still there. He had adoration. Men loved him. Women loved him. Children loved him. And how many people go through life like that? To have accomplished what he accomplished and to have that brutal fall from grace, really an American tragedy. I don't know how I ended up here. I, I just don't know how I ended up here. I felt the goodness in myself and the goodness I gave him. I don't feel any goodness in myself right now. I felt I had some last thing I gotta say to somebody. Please remember me as a good guy. Please. 